Hey guys, it's Mei and my trusty sidekick. Oh, Vinny's here. Is it still there, Shannon? Um, I don't know. I think it literally, sorry y'all, we had a little technical issue. I think it literally toggled because when I went in, the comments were there and then they went away. And it's like it sent me to the other show. Isn't that strange? You're on the right place now. We'll figure it out. If there's an issue, we'll figure it out. So welcome into the Crafter Show. And today I'm doing something super fun. I think it's going to be super fun. It's what I wanted to do with these recipe cards from the minute that I got them in. I think they are adorable and I'm going to show you. So the, this is not my book. Let me show you. I can't open this one because it's not mine. I've already, we've already been playing with mine. This is a recipe card book. It's made by Doodlebug and it's in their Made With Love line. It is so cute. You get 36 recipe cards in this little book. How cute is it, right? And I'm going to show you a project. I can take my glasses off so I can see what I'm doing. I'm going to show you a project that is a don't blink craft because it's easy, but I think it's something we will really, really love. So you guys know that we have this punch in our store and we also have, I thought I put them over here and I just heard them. Yeah, here they are. Yeah, Ooh. The baby ones. yeah And we are. also have these, the Happy Planner binder pieces. We're going to turn this into a recipe book, and it is so cute. We've already practiced to make sure it would work because I didn't want to bring this to you if it wouldn't, but let me show you. So Shannon discovered you can take these recipe book pages five at a time. Yes, and you, you don't even have to tear them apart. Like you can leave five of them together. Oh, that probably helps. So she took five recipe pages off at one time, okay? And then on your punch, here's what she told me to do because Shannon practiced. I didn't. I will watch you. She's, her first card lines up right to the edge of the punch. Ignore this little, ignore the um, template or pattern. You know, you have a, what is that called, you reckon? You have this spot here that we'll use in a minute. Ignore that spot. What you're going to do is put your cards in, and I'll hold it up where you can see it. Put your cards in, put your thumb on the other side to support it, where it is right to the edge. You see that? I've pulled that right to the edge, and that's your first punch, Okay. I wanted to make sure you saw that. So that's punch number one. And then what Shannon told me <laughs> is when you put this over into the little template piece, which is right here, what you have to make sure of is that you're pressing your cards down to the base because if you don't, you'll punch a little off. Like if you lift up a little bit, it can punch a little off. So make sure you punch down. So your first punch was that one right, that we lined it up to the edge and then you just follow this out. Look how easy this is. And even if it goes a little off, it still works because I accidentally went a little off and it still doesn't make it completely messed up. And all you do is punch all the way down as many times as you can and it's even. It's virtually even. It's barely off. But these little cards, and we did it on the bottom because I, the top didn't leave us a whole lot of room. So we did this on the bottom and then what you do, let me punch all of these. Which punch is that, Shannon? They want it's to know. It's the power punch. Tamitha linked it right above. Hey, Tam, can you keep up with the links so we can put them in the description? What's hap what happens is when people come back tonight, they don't have the links. We need to put them in the descri description as well. So. Is it from Crocodile? It is a Crocodile power punch. I'm going to pull these apart so I don't have to do it afterwards. Yeah. I'll be I sad, won't I? It doesn't matter. I mean, either way, you have to pull them apart. The Either only before thing, if you pull them apart after, you do have to be careful that you the little hold it down well because it does kind of want to pull after it's been punched. So I'm going to do it again, and I'm just going to line this up with the edge of the punch, and then you just place that punch in the little, what is that thing? What would you call it? It's a... It's like a little holder. I, I don't know, though. It's a little... There's got to be a name for that. It's a little it spot. Might say it on the pack. Oh, in the, in the instructions for it, it probably does say it. Now, remember, there's 36 sheets, but Shannon's already done a bunch, so we could get ahead of the game on this. So, punch. Guide. Guide. Yeah, guide. You think that's good. what it is? It's a guide. I'm holding this where y'all can't see what I'm doing. Y'all, the thing I love about We Are Memory Keepers punches like this is the hand dexterity. I'm going through five pages. Watch this. And you might be able to go through more, but... Look, I'm going to hold it at the very end, watch. That's cool, right? That's what I love. Because five, it's not, it wasn't like hard. Then I'm going to peel these away from each other. And then I'm going to stack them up. And then we're going to take some discuses. 
I'll just, I'm going to use what Shannon did. So Shannon took different colors of disc and you load them on and look, it opens like this. Look how stinking cute this recipe book is. Come on. And this is with the small disc. If you added the bigger disc, you could even put more in. Now, I don't know how this is going to go. This is, this may be too many. Let's see how many we can put on comfortably. Yeah, I did find out the fewer you try to put on at a time, yeah. the easier it is. And when you put them on, here's what you do. Just place them and just push these down like that, and they'll go right into their little spot. Did you see that? So I'm just taking like three or four, five, something like that. Place it like this and just kind of press in between. This is just like you do with like your happy planners. Y'all have had happy planners, right, where they have this. So press, 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 press. Y'all, how cute, how quick is this gift? It's pretty cool, isn't it? Uh, yeah, it is. And the other thing I like about it, let me show you this. Number one is, I do not, look, that's perfect, and that's a whole pack. Look, and you can flip it, like, look, that's so cool. That's super cool. Okay, the other thing I love is, you don't have to decorate these. They're already decorated for you, so you don't have to add any dimension, okay? That's so we're right, we're going to We're going to add a cover. She's reading our mind. We're gonna, <laughs> that's why I was hurrying, because I want to add a cover, so I hurried to put this together. Um, and I'm going to try making the cover and the back of the chipboard and see if they'll still fit. Worst case scenario, I'll either need to use the larger disc or I'll need to use less. I, I might could make two out of this. Yeah. You easily could make two recipe books out of this. Have plenty of rings or discs. Plenty. Because look how many you get in a box. And Shannon went and used like one of every color. Look. Oh, yeah. You get so many. Um, let's do oh. a cover. Show some. Some versatility. I got to walk away a second. Well, it was perfect. There were six spots and six colors. So. I'm going to use chipboard and see what happens. This could be a mistake. You know why it could be? Mm. My chipboard cutter. I do not have a replacement blade for my chipboard cutter <laughs> because all my blades are still good. All right, so these are four by six, yeah. I'm going to make my cover the very same size. I hope I didn't rush through that too fast, but I wanted to get to this part. <laughs> did it feel rushed or did it make sense? If it made sense to Vince, then yeah, it probably I mean, made sense. I mean, it's pretty simple. Okay. I did it, so it's easy. Shannon did it from me just going, do this, do this, do this. <laughs> and I just love how it turned out. She's the one who figured out the spacing, too. That worked great. Just a little playing. So I'm doing these at four by six, the same size as the recipe cards, because I don't need any edges around it, really. So, oh, perfect. Perfect. So what I'm going to do is punch these holes. I don't even think I have to punch them yet. I think I can decorate and then punch. I mean, even if I go through a decoration, it's super cute on here, too, right? Let's decorate. Let's decorate. Oh, let's pick our sticker. Because <laughs> I want this on the front. Yeah? Yeah. Let's pick a sticker. I really want to use this stove. I love that. I think I'm going to have to use the stove on the front. You like the stove? Well, the stove would be appropriate for sure. Or a mixer. The mixer, the mixer's cute. I'm going to save the confetti. These guys are cute too, but I can save them for something else. This is cute. You know, and if you did, I mean, you know, I don't know all this stuff, so I'm just going to throw this out there. If you did the cover like you do the cover for your uh, calendar, you could stand it up. Yeah, you could. You know why that's not a big deal for me in this one? Because in my what I think I'll do is remove the recipe. Hmm. I think I will be the person that goes, this is the one I want to make, and pull it out and bring it to my work surface. Does it make sense? Sure. Yeah. I don't, I have so many books that do that. Yeah. You know, that I think I would want this one. What I love about it, too, is it can fit in my kitchen drawer. This is what I was thinking. Okay. For those of you who don't know, I'm doing this new diet thing, this new dash diet thing. And there are recipes that I get from all over the place. And I just thought this would be the perfect place to put them. And then because I'm cooking it so much, to stick this in my kitchen drawer. Wouldn't that be neat? Yeah. I expect this to be very worn and tattered. That's my plan, anyway. All right, I've already cut into this. There's a project coming. I've already cut into it. Um, 
Let me see. Let me see. So I have these little border pieces I can definitely use. I have all these cute things on here. Um, I think I could use the stove. Oh, look, baked with love would be cute next to the stove. Wood in it. Ooh, there's even little tabs if you wanted to use them. What do I want to use on the front? This is the hard part, y'all. Okay, let's look in here. Let's see what got. Look, I've already cut paper away. I've already been cutting. Ooh. Nope. Let's keep, oh, this yellow is cute. This little stripe is cute. This floral is cute. I'm going to keep that out. This plaid. I'm the plaid girl. I'm going to skip the cupcakes. This pink is cute, but it says love you, so I'm going to save that for something else. But this is cute with the heart. Okay, let's start by this. Let's put some, let's do plaid. Let's start with plaid. Everybody agree plaid? I think so. Plaid. We're going to go with plaid. Here's my trimmer I'm using today. Okay, so I'm going to cut this down to four by six. This is the other thing, too. If you were making these as gifts, you can get a bunch out of your paper pad. Because four by six, I can get two, four, six pieces from this. You know what I'm saying? Pretty cool, huh? Yeah. Pretty cool. And I think I'm going to cover all of it with this piece. That might seem like overkill, but I really love this piece. It's all that matters. Yeah, whatever you like. Do you. Um... Sandra, you can get my recipes at the on our YouTube channel at Vinnie's Vittles. I have an album for yours already. In case somebody's saying I should make this for Vinnie's recipes, I already have that. Somebody did say <coughs> that, but we have one that we we have a tutorial for how you can make it, and I have one myself. All right. Um, yes, this um, paper pack matches those rings um, perfectly. perfectly. Well, and so do the recipe things. Like they were made for yeah. each other. Like they were made for each other. That's why I had to use one of every color too. Perfectly. Okay. Oh, look at that. Oh, I may use some of those. But I'm not going to use chocolate. Not in this book. <laughs> chocolate. It's one of the things you can't have. Snacks. <laughs> oh, I can have some. It's so funny. I was telling them that last night I was in the middle of the night. I was looking at recipes for the Dash Diet. And um, there I, found, I ran across this like chart that tells you what you can and can't have and on the side of the can't haves this is what it said it said pastries baked goods snacks and i'm like what do you mean i can't have snacks i can't have healthy snacks i can't have any snack just mm. snacks you can't have them <laughs> i thought that was funny no snacks Let's or depressing see. depending on how you want to look at it but no I'm with you come on who i'm gonna eat snacks Although i'm not a big snacker i'm gonna eat snacks whether they tell me I can or not. I'm using the cut aparts on this side because I want y'all to see it. I think it's cute. I should say, you're going the wrong side. Nah, I was warning you because I knew somebody would be like, stop it. Stop it. Look at this. They're perfect. They're perfect. They're so perfect. So cute. Okay. So I'm going to sit that there and let Let's that. Go to get it like milk and cookies. Now I'm going to do this one. I like milk and cookies. Let me see what the other ones are. These one. These one. Okay, so I'm going to cut another one. Trimble. Just had you. Here you are. Yeah, trimble, 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 trimble. Does anybody else's trash can become a holder like an extra desk? I even cleaned it out. I came in this morning and I went, somebody took my trash out. I should have known, right? Yeah. It was me. Shannon's like, it was me. Now, there's sometimes she's not going to say it was her, but today I like, took your trash out. It was kind of overflowing, and I figured by the time we crafted today, it'd be a mess. Well, it wasn't to overflowing yet. By the time we crafted today, it would be to overflowing. Yeah. Because I crafted yesterday, and you don't know about it. It's a secret. Not really a secret. Aww. I started a project for you yesterday. For me? Yeah. It's real cute. I'm, I'll show him because I'm going to show the viewers because I think it's a neat thing. 
I think it's neat. We had one of our winners. We would actually had both of our winner calls yesterday. We had, if you didn't know, at Christmas we gave away mystery boxes that came with some mystery prizes in them. And one of the pr mystery prizes was a two-hour Zoom call with me. And we had ended up with two winners, right? Yes. Yes. And we, we did those calls this week. And yes. so one of the ladies wanted to make a mini album together. So we started working on a mini album. And she was making one for her Eagle Scout son with the Mente Wilderness Pack. Mm, cool. And I needed one for the photos I took at your property for you. Uh -huh. Yeah. And I started mine at the same time. And it's cute. Very. It's cute. Well, we're fixing to be taking a lot of pictures as they make changes to our property. Yeah, and you know what I didn't get? The other day when you took your parents, I didn't get a picture of that. Uh, redo. I thought about it after the fact. I thought that would have been cute. Did you take a picture with them? I didn't. Wouldn't that have been cute? Well, I mean, we could take one the next time. Yeah. All right, I think I'm going to use, here's the thing about this sticker. With it being white, I think it'll pop better on a really dark background. Did so you put paper on both sides? I did. Okay, just make sure your um, cut aparts are the way you want them when you go to decorate the front. I did, but thank you, because orientation is my nemesis. <laughs> but I did check that. But orientation is my nemesis. I know. Just trying to help. I appreciate your help. Because I sure. have um, did my recipe book, you know, one page upside down. And then the next page right side up. So, yeah. Three by six. <gasps> Ooh, border punch, border punch, border punch. Border punch, border punch. I guess I could use the new border punch today. I'm going to use this one because I need to show y'all this one, not for the faint of heart. This border punch. <laughs> <laughs> this one you have to pay attention to, guys. Let me tell you why. When you get it, it's the most beautiful punch, how it turns out. But see how little bit of a pattern you have on the end to match up? you got to pay attention. So you'll take your, punch, your paper, and I just center it in there and make my first punch. I'm going to try to do this sitting down. And then I line up these little dots very carefully and make sure I'm in well. I messed one up yesterday, but after I did it on my second try, I didn't mess anything up. That's working great. Look how pretty this punch is. So good. So good. Y'all know I'm a border punch fan. It was hmm. fun. Yeah, you used I one for the first I time. Ms. Jones said you could use those rings for jewelry also. <laughs> Just wear them. I mean, you can make them like in a necklace. Yeah, because you can string through the little hearts. Um, what was it I said the other day I wanted to wear like a pendant? It was something mini we got in. Or something somebody gave me. I was like, I just want to wear it. it. Oh, it was, was it the basket you gave me? <laughs> the bunny basket? Maybe. Probably. I always want to wear everything. That is so pretty. Yeah, I like this border punch so much. You have to take your time. But the payoff, guys, look at it. So good. It is. Look, we're all my clean, and, clean it out friends. Look, if I give it to Shannon, she might do it. <laughs> so here's my cover. Here's my little piece I want to add to it. That's so pretty. Let's open up our little. Well, it is. Look at all the cute little colored pokey dots. Checking my orientation. Look how perfect the stove is. Okay, let's put a sticker down. So the little pokey dots, are they anything like glitter? No, pokey dots are better than glitter. You don't think they would stick to you? No, it's bad as glitter. Like glitter. I don't like glitter. I have this piece left that I, I used like earlier glitter. on something else. I don't like glitter. Or yesterday. The border punches sold out really quick. I was really shocked at how fast they did. So they're on order and should be back soon. We got a new one in today that I'll be showing in the after show. Yep. So I know that's here. I'm going to put this little sticker down. Okay, Nicole said the hearts are upside down. Oh, who cares? I'll fix it for Nicole. I would never have noticed it or cared about it. <laughs> Y'all got to know that's how I craft. I just don't stress. Don't stress. I actually had this conversation with Kelly yesterday. I said, you know, that it triggers some people that I don't care. Because some people really care. I would have left it and been about my life. 
Do you believe that about me? Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> That's bad, isn't it? It don't have to be cute. It just has to function. Is that what I tell you all the time, Vince? All the time. Okay. Oven. Little something loving, or what is it? L little loving from the oven. <laughs> I couldn't think of what it was. So Joe wants to know where she can find the mixer in the stove. Um, if we have them, they'll link them. Y'all, you know what you could do with this? You could use it as a template to make another stove. You literally could, and then make yourself a stove and use your stance with your faces, and mm -hmm. you totally could do that. Is it a challenge for me to show y'all how I do it? That's pretty cool, because that means the mixer would work too, right? Did Doodlebug realize they gave us a two for one? I don't know. A two for one? A two for one? Okay, let's decide what we're putting <laughs> beside it. I kind of liked you baked, baked with happy. love. Look how cute. Oh, so cute. And what about, what about, what about, what about? What about what? I heart this, meh. I, I think that I would care if I put it down wrong. It would drive me insane. I would I wouldn't have noticed it today or later. I promise. <laughs> well, I mean, you know, just like last week when I was doing the thing, it drove me. If it didn't look right, it drove me insane. I told you, you were much pickier than I expected. I Shannon understand. would have Shannon would have stopped what she was. I'm just saying. That's why I said, hey, are your cut aparts the right orientation? So when you I mean, flip it, you can still read them. Those lampstand things. I'd go back and fix it today if she wouldn't have a fit. It drives me insane that they're not right. Oh my gosh, tell them that. Let me just say this. To each his own, I'm just, I just want to say to you that that's how I craft and it would not have affected me one bit. Like, but that's I mean, okay. that's okay. We're all different. Yeah, I want to just make sure everybody knows that's okay. You do you. I got to decide what I want to put on here. Kim says she's throwing down that gauntlet. Or throwing that gauntlet down for you, May May. It's a challenge. Kim. Dixon. Yeah, I missed it. What did I miss? Baking the world a better place. Are you kidding me? Butter than ever. I need to go home and bake now. <gasps> These are so cute. Donna. I'm not arguing <laughs> with that fact. I, I'm always in favor of you going home and baking something. Please tell them about your lamps, babe. What do you want me to say about it? They're beautiful. They tell are. Them they about did turn them. out good, but. You can show um, them a picture. You want to show them a picture? You have okay. a picture of them. Well, tell them about them first. Like, what are they? Where did they come from? Yada, yada. Tell them that. Well, I mean, I don't know where you got the idea from, but Amazon. I told you I thought I could do it. Babe, here's where I got the idea from. When I was shopping for the lamps, because I wanted those kind of lamps, on Amazon, in the sample photo, they had shutters similar. They were smaller. Remember me and Shannon looked yeah. at them. I'm like, Shannon, we could do this, right? Mm -hmm. So, Vinny no, figured it out. Yeah, <laughs> Vinny did it. <laughs> I don't know if you can. Yeah, I guess you can see them pretty good here. Let me show y'all. Show it. Okay. So these. Let me get it where you can see it. These lamps. Let me tap. Nina, send the cookies. Here we go. Let me get a pointer. So beside my bed, you see these lamps beside the bed. These are lamps that can mount to the wall or can be hardwired. We didn't hardwire them. We just, so Vince made for me these six foot tall, they are six foot tall shutters. And him and Joe made them. Um, they're made out of one by fours and stain. One by four screws and stain, that's it. I think it's one by sixes. Are they one by sixes? Yeah. And then um, he did three across, he did the little bar across here. There's a bar at the bottom, but they lean against the wall behind my nightstands. They are in I love them so much. But on one of them. Are you taking orders? Somehow we did a cut wrong or something or another. We didn't space it exactly right. So the crossbar on the bottom does not match up exactly. And that but drives me okay, insane. But it's on the bottom. It's on the bottom. So it's hidden. So you can't see it. But the still. Next when you make for me, just make sure you line them up. Make sure I do it right. <laughs> No you. one will ever see it. His mom came in and was looking at him. She was so impressed. And she, he was telling her, and she was like, no one will know that. And he, I said, I know. That's what I told him. No one would ever see it. But how lucky am I? Aren't they gorgeous? I love them. They are yeah, they turned out good. I just wish I could fix it. <laughs> but that's just me. Aww, and let me tell you why we did that. We still don't know if we're going to stay in our house or sell our house. The kids are all growing up. 
the house is getting bigger and bigger, you know, like as rooms are emptier and emptier. So we, we're on the fence. We're not in a hurry. We're not trying. But I was like, I'd hate to mount all this to the wall and then us sell the house and I can't just easily take them with me. So I was like, if we did this floor to lean on the wall, they're literally lamps I can take with me. So I love it. Julie, I feel confident that there's some way that we can work out me delivering some. <laughs> Early next fall. I know, beyond a shadow of a doubt, that's Julie Bush. I know, without even looking. You are correct. Early next fall. That's funny. Y'all, they were, they're so easy. It's such an easy project. If we do make some for Shannon, we'll film it. How about that? Yeah. We may have enough wood. She just had to get her lamps. They're not, y'all, those lamps were like $39 a piece. Uh -oh. And they're dimmable. They're like dimmable. And we just mounted them to the wood. They're awesome. Maybe we should have filmed it. I don't know. I, I think they don't want to see this Julie stuff. Julie said we'll trade for hunting time hey. in Colorado. Done deal. You guys, look how stinking cute this is. Oh, that is cute. That's so easy. If y'all don't make this as a gift for somebody, yourself or someone else. I already have my rifle set up to come to Colorado. So just got to say the word. I'm going to tell you, Vince, this this is a cute project, and if you can get any of this stuff, look, that's what you were showing me. Look, when this one gets full, it just opens and says, hello. It just starts, like, pushing it just, open. It just opens. Hello. <laughs> look. It's, it's one I'm that full. she will have to empty you after have, using. You don't have a choice. It's like, it goes. <laughs> that's funny. See, look, this is it closed, and when it fills up, it just opens on you. That's funny. All right, so. This may be one of my favorite projects I've done all year. Because I like quick and big payoff. All right, so put it on. You just play, place it down, smash them in. That's how I put them on anyway. You guys, look at this. This would make for a cute mini album. Look at this. Seriously. Shannon, I was going to make you one. I was going to split this in half and make you one, but I think we need to just make you a separate oh, one yeah That's we just cute. need to make you a separate one because what i love is how many recipes i can get in here over the years and never have this huge recipe book this is adorable it is very and when i put it in my drawer i'm going to stand it like that and y'all you can seriously make this thing in like 15 minutes i mean you could really make it in 15 minutes and i studied it <laughs> like yeah. i studied the front and all this kind of stuff i had to put that i love this because i love this album that's what I was thinking. I think for us, Lisa, it's not about getting a smaller house. It's about getting a one-level house. <laughs> we don't care. That's all. I don't They're care if it's got... my one-level floor plan. Very much so. We would very much like a one-level house. It is nice. I, said, I, I always said I wouldn't mind having two levels until we went to the mountains um, before Christmas. And Blake and I were downstairs. And... You had to climb those stairs. The only problem Multiple with going downstairs, times. going downstairs, is, is you got to come back uh, up. That's the problem. Going yeah. downs is the easy part. The downs, the downs are easy. The ups. And it's the worst part for us. If you've never seen, you probably have never seen the full layout of my house because I don't film that. But the worst part for us is to bring groceries in. You bring them upstairs to, because downstairs is just man cave and a bedroom. Mm -hmm. So everything ups, everything has to come upstairs, and that's really hard. And when the boys were there, it wasn't so bad because groceries we would take one trip because there were five or six of us at home, you know. But poor Joe, you know, between Joe and us, it's three trips. <laughs> and then three more trips for Joe. Well, not necessarily. So it depends on the grocery day, but sometimes you and me and him can do it in two trips, you know, and not not just... But typically, Joe ha will make a deal with me. Joe doesn't mind the stairs because he's young, right? And he'll use make a deal with me where if I'll put the groceries away, because he hates to put them away. And I'm like, well, I'd rather put them away because then I know everything gets where it needs to go. So and if I, I put them away, he'll bring them in. <laughs> yeah, and then know where it's at when I need it. Yeah, I don't care if, it's, if the house takes up three acres as long as it's one level. But I don't want that side. We were talking about this the other day. Yeah, I mean, we're, we we're not looking that. for just, that. That's know. not what... Probably we won't go anywhere. We keep going. We're moving. We're not. We're moving. We're not. <laughs> we keep doing it. We're staying. We're going. We're looking. We're not. We just keep, we don't know what we're doing. We're going to wait and see what God does. If he, if somebody makes an offer. <laughs> yeah, that'd be the when scary part. When it's meant to be, it will be. It will be. 
All right, guys. Our real estate agent is very anxious to get our house on the market. Thanks, Tam. You're so sweet. Oh, I didn't separate this page. Put a fridge and pantry downstairs. Well, we have that. <laughs> but you still, but, but the, the stove is upstairs. upstairs. And the stove is upstairs. We don't have a pantry downstairs. We have a freezer downstairs and a fridge. But it's just a dorm fridge. But we still use it sometimes. You use it for drinks and mm -hmm. stuff like that. Listen, the downstairs was Tom, uh, Josh and Taylor's apartment and Thomas and Jenna's apartment. It was never Jared's because Jared moved to Texas right out, right out of school. But Josh lived there all through school until him and Taylor married, and then they came and lived for not a year, maybe a no, year. They were, they're about a year and a half. Yeah, a year. That's right, because that's right. And then um, they rented Shannon's house. house. Now Shannon is their landlord. Whoop, whoop. They're <laughs> the best tenants ever. It is a, yeah, they, oh man, what good tenants. I'm not kidding, because I've been in the business. I know <laughs> what good ones. All right, guys, that's the recipe book. We're going to cut away from this and go to the after show. And I got to tell you something. If you need a cup of coffee, a soda, a water, a restroom break, you need to take it now, because we're going to be here a while in the after show. We have a lot to tell you, a lot to show you, a lot's going on. Not nothing. It's not drama, but there's a lot of product that came in and... I'm excited because spring, I told y'all spring's hitting, so new products coming and we'll show you. All right, guys, so we will see you in the after show. Have we put that link in? Let's pray that link works. Well, do you want me to go to it first? When you started earlier, there's two. So I'm going to the one that's not showing live. Look at Jenny. That's as adorable as you and Benny and Shannon. How cute is that? Thank you, Jenny. So what do you want me to do? You want me to go to it and you keep this chat open in case you need to come put a link in it? I can't. No. You can keep that chat open. I've Penny. got it open. Yeah. I linked the Both? one that's not showing live. The one that's not showing live. Yeah. We're going to try this, guys. Worst so, case scenario, don't close this window out because I think you can come back to this. So, All right. We'll see you in the after show in just a few minutes. Bye now. Hey, guys. It's May May. I'm a trusty sidekick. Oh, Vinny's here. Am I in the right spot? I don't know. All right. We're going to see if we're in the right spot because a while ago it messed us up. And we don't know what happened. So let's see. Let us see if there's anybody here. If there's not, I'm going to start a new one. I won't have a choice. There are people in the chat. It's live, I think. But I, Can y'all see us? I can't see it yet. Kim's here. Kim's here. So she can see us. So we're in the right place. We had a little issue earlier. No, We've noticed not that going live. our. You're um, not on. Or not that I can see. People are commenting, but. It says we've been live 30 minutes. Well, you know that's not right. I mean, 30 seconds. I'm sorry. Still nothing, Shannon? No. Mine says waiting for May May. Okay. Okay, Shannon at least has a commercial Tamitha now. just sent me still live in the first show. How is that possible? Yep. Still in the first show live. Is it, are you seeing it too? Uh -huh. Stampin' says we are not.